Could I come inside? There's a storm and I'm just a frail old nun. Of course! Nuns are my favorite meal. I mean, non-consumable profession. Let's give her a tour of me casa. Home! Nope. I don't know. I think she's kind of hot. This is my garbage disposal. Sorry, it's a mess. I just had company over. <laughs> this is my soul aquarium. <laughs> now I'll show you the soul extraction room. Good. That gives me the chance to extract your soul. Aw, that's adorable. My turn. <laughs> Actually, now for a riddle. What's white and black and red all over? Uh, uh, I'm not crawling down the uh, stairs. Uh, Pokies, uh, here go. Uh, Yay, I caught a new pet. Pet? You're keeping it? I'm calling her Mitten. Now let's teach Mittens how to play fetch with a severed head. <sighs> Okay, Simba, it's time you learn about the great circle of life. Why are our neighbors here? I'm your neighbor! And I'm Simba's best friend! I, I know you are. They're here to help me demonstrate about the great circle of life. Oh, okay, so is Mr. Antelope gonna do one of his presentations like how he does in school? Ah! Ah! Oh my god, Dad, why are you eating him? The circle of life. The circle of life is murder? Mostly, yes. It's okay, Simba. I'm more than happy to offer my fleshy carcass as fuel for the king to protect my son. Thanks, Daddy. Until, of course, the day you have the rumblies and need to eat my son. Yay! <laughs> okay, you know what? I don't think I want to be king anymore. Well, you don't really have a choice since I ate your brothers. I Brothers? And someday when I perish, hopefully not in a horrifically gruesome way that'll forever be burnt into your core memory and traumatize you for years to come, you won't have to worry about competition either! You're welcome! I had brothers! Oh, can I have my dad's skull? Of course you can, Happy Meal! Uh, uh, hey! Uh, uh, your kid is throwing balls at my dog! He's just playing around. Boys will be boys! Boys will be boys. Uh, what the? Now your kid is taking a whiz on my car. I mean, you gotta drain the main vein somewhere. Boys will be boys. Kid! Move out of the way. I have to go to work. <sighs> what was that? Oh, shit. Come on, kid. You're okay. Salutations, neighbor. Isn't it a lovely day? What? British. Hey, son, are you okay? What was that noise? Total spother. It's me, your offspring. I do not have a possible skull fracture, so don't come over here. Okay, dinner's in five minutes. So if my phone is connected to the Wi-Fi, does that mean Tick Pop is connected to the satellites in space? Uh, th that's not how Wi-Fi works. Because that's where the aliens live and I don't want to get probed again. Is it true if I download Tick Tick, my phone's camera will send mind-controlling radio waves into my brain? What? You know, like when doctors give you shots? It's actually just them putting mind control chips in you. Oh my god. I heard ticks carry diseases. Will I get a disease if I download that? Tic Tac on my portable phone device? No, ticks are a type of bug. Tic Tac is- That's a good point. I don't want to get another disease. I just got one from my cousin last week. What? Listen, at the end of the day, we're- We're just- Oh my god, did, did he just die? Just trying to protect the children. Please help, my daughter's possessed. No worries, intern exorcist Kelly is here. <laughs> Let's check it out. The first thing you want to do is duct tape the child's head so it stops spinning all spookishly. <laughs> After that, it's going to start levitating, so what I like to do is guide the floaty demon child into the fan. Oh my god! Now that she's taking a nap, we're just gonna soak it in some rice and finally add some holy water and say the phrase The power of rice compels you! The power of rice compels you! Ah, man, you got me! I always do! Hey, you wanna hang out next weekend? Yeah, sure thing, bro! I... Peace! Wait, why, why isn't my daughter awake? Oh, she's dead! What? But you removed the evil spirit! 
story. Yeah, but her head spun around like seven times, dude. Uh. I don't know how to fix that part. You might need like a doctor or something.